you hear the word family? Family. Is what? What do you think? What can you say about family? Uh, mm -hmm. The people in your family. Mm -hmm. Go, Tina. <laughs> My grandma, my grandma, and me, and mother, and brother. Okay, what about grandfather and father? Do you have? No. Oh, no, all right. So, uh, if you don't mind, Tina, where is your grandfather? Where? Brother lives in. Brother lives in. You can do it. <laughs> Go, Tina. Brother uh -huh. lives and work in Ho Chi Minh City. Oh, I see. So your father is not on your home. You're not with your father. Is it correct, Tina? Yes. Okay. So at your home, you only have your brother. You only have your grandmother and only your mother. Is it correct? Mm, yes. All right. What about your brother? How many brothers do you have? I have a brother. Only one? Yes. All right. May, may I know your brother's name? Is it okay? Uh, coffee. Brother, my, my brother's name is Coffee. Wow. What a beautiful name. <laughs> okay. What about sister? Do you have a Tina? Do you have sister? My name is Sister. Mm -hmm. I mean, do you have a sister? Because you said you have brother, right? What about sister? Younger or older sister? Do you have? No. No. All right. Only you. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So, all right. Thank you so much for that one, Tina. So, are you still okay? Yes. Are you getting nervous? Are you getting nervous, Tina? Yes. Oh, no. So, please take a deep breath. Inhale like this. Then exhale. <laughs> All right. One more time. Take a deep breath. Then exhale. Are you okay right now? Okay. All right. So now, Tina, let us continue our lesson. So here we have the vocabulary. So in this part, we're going to learn some vocabulary. And those are how many members how many member in, in family, in child, family, children, children, have, have. girl. Mm. And boy. Boy. All right. So those are the vocabulary that you should know tonight. So we use those vocabulary in order for us to communicate or to complete the sentence that we are creating. Like, for example, we are talking to someone. We can use those vocabulary. Oh here okay so this time tina i just want you to read all of it one more time go how many member in mm -hmm. family two children have all right boy okay very good so again we use how many if we are asking all right like for example how many 
um, family member do you have? So you're gonna answer teacher in numbers or in quantity. Yes. All right. So if teacher will ask you, how many family members do you have? What is your answer, Tina? Uh, there are. You can do it, Tina. Six people in your family, in my family. Okay, very good sentence. So you can say it this way. We have six family members. Go, Tina. We have six family members. All right, very good. <laughs> and here we have the vocabulary member. Like what you mentioned, those are the part of a certain organization or a certain thing. So example, the family. So there's a family member on that one. And next is in. We use in to complete a sentence. Like for example, I live in Vietnam. Okay, we use in to complete the sentence. Did you understand? Yes or no, Tina? Family. Yeah. Okay, next is the family. Like what you've mentioned earlier, family consists of members. We have grandmother, grandfather, mother, father, brothers, and sisters. Those are family. And next one is child. If we talk oh about only one, we call this as child, okay? If only one, but if there are so many child, we call it as children. Again, if many, what do you call it? Children. What if we only have one? Two. We, oh, child. <laughs> Can you please read that is child? So what happened? Is there something wrong? Okay, so going back to this one, when we say child, we talk about only one. But if we talk about many, 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 many child, we call this as children. And have, we use it in a sentence, like for example, I have comb. I okay, so can you please use have in a sentence? Have. I have a computer. Wow, very good. <laughs> oh, nice. And this time we have the word girl, like us. Tina and teacher Resi is girl. And if we said boy, we boy. call it like your father, like your grandfather, and your brother. They are? They are. Boy or girls? They are boy. Very good. They are boys. What about your grandmother, your mother, your sisters, and you? They are? They are. Girl and boy. Girls only. <laughs> because mother and grandpa grandmother. So they are girl. Okay, so next one we have this one. So I just want you to listen on this part, Tina, because later we're gonna read it together, okay? Are you married? Yes, I am. How many members are there in your family? There are four members in my family. How many children do you have? Okay, there you go. Did you listen it? Yeah. Do you want to listen one more time? Let's listen again, Tina. Yes or no? Yes. Okay, so let's listen one more time. Are you married? Yes, I am. How many members are there in your family? 
There are four members in my family. How many children do you have? I have one. One girl. Nice. Okay, so this time, Tina, let's read it alternately, okay? So, Amber part is Tina, for Tina. Four. Tina. So, this is for Tina. Amber part is for Tina. And David is for Teacher Resi. Yeah. Okay, so let's read it alternately. So, let's start. Go. Are you married? Yes, I am. How many members are there in your family? There are four members in my family. How many children do you have? I have one girl. Nice. Okay, very good, Tina. Good job. So this time, Tina, let's have this one. Here, yeah. let's have your language booster. So teacher will gonna ask you and you should answer teacher question. Did you understand, Dina? Oh, yeah. Okay, no, 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 no. Teacher will ask you and you should answer teacher, okay? All right, so this time, teacher will gonna ask, how many members are there in your family? Uh, there are four people in, your, in my family. Okay, but like what I said earlier, there are, how many again? Five or six? Five. There are six. Okay, so please say it. There are six members in my family. Go, Tina. Yes. Oh, say it one more time. There are six members there in my family. Mem there are six members in my family. Okay, very good. So here, teacher will gonna ask you, how many children do you have? Do you have, Tina? <laughs> Okay, what is your answer? Okay, if no, you can say it as no, I haven't. Please say it. Teacher will ask you, how many children do you have? No, I haven't. Go, Tina. No, I haven't. Yes. Very good. All right. So th that's the way you answer those questions if you don't have any children <laughs> because you're too young, Tina. How many? How old are you, Tina? Um, I'm 12 years old. Oh, you're 12 years old. But can you please say it? I am 12 years old. I am 12 years old. Okay, very nice, Tina. And let's read it one more time, Tina. But this time, this is for um, Tina. This is for teacher Rasi, for Tina and teacher Rasi again. So let's do this, Tina, go. How many... Member are there in your family? There are five members in my family. How many children do you have? I have two. One girl and one boy. Okay, so now let's have this one. But this time, teacher will remove the drawings. All right, there you go. Here. Yes. Let us practice the things that we learn today, okay? So again, we talk about what? What did we discuss? It's about... <laughs> what did we learn today? What did we study? It's about... Pa... It's about 
<laughs> what did we study today tonight it's about fa family right is it correct we study about family Tina okay so again, <laughs> it's okay, Tina. It's okay. It's okay. So we're going to practice what we learned today. So again, we talk about family. So teacher will going to ask you, how important is family? How important? Yes. How important? How do you value your family when you mm -hmm. you can do it tina is your family important to you is your mother father it's... brother is important Mm -hmm. Is your family important or not? Of course, yes. Do you love your family, Tina? Uh, Do you love them? <laughs> okay, can you hear me? Is my sound really good? Hello. Yes. All right. Yes. But you're having hard time to understand what I say. Is it correct? Yeah. Uh, it's okay, Tina. Don't worry. Teacher will help you to understand what I say. Okay. But teacher will ask you, do you love your family? Yes. Yes, of course. <laughs> so, is your parents strict? Yes. 